In this lecture, we will discuss problems and their solutions based on the relation between draw and central moment. Meaning thereby, we are taking up only those questions which involves relation between the three types of moment that is moment about the mean, moment about the origin and moment about any arbitrary point. For rest types of question we will discuss in the next lecture. Let us discuss question based on the relation between the moments. The three moments we are discussing only the questions based on the relation of these three moments about mean, about arbitrary point and about the origin. And let us move on and understand the question first. So the question says the first four moments of a distribution about x is equal to 2. So what does this mean about x is equal to 2 means that our arbitrary point a is equal to 2. So it means that our mu 1 dash, mu 2 dash, mu 3 dash and mu 4 dash are given. That is moment about the arbitrary points. So these are 1, 2.5, 5.5 and 16. Okay. Now what do we have to calculate? We have to calculate the first four moments about the mean and about the origin that is we have to calculate all the moments that is mu r that is we have to calculate mu 1, mu 2, mu 3 and mu 4 and similarly we have to find nu 1, nu 2, nu 3, nu 4. I hope the question is clear now. Let us move on and solve this question and let us move on and find the moments about mean first. We will be using the relation which we had derived in our previous video. So in order to understand this, please go through the previous video and see the relations which we had derived. Okay. So the first one says mu 1 is always 0 and this holds, this is always true. You can write it as it is. Then write the relation between mu 2 and mu 2 dash. It is mu 2 dash minus mu 1 dash square and this is equal to what is mu 2 dash? It is 2.5 minus 1 whole square and this will come out to be 1.5. Let us find mu 3 and write the relation that is mu 3 dash minus 3 mu 2 dash mu 1 dash plus 2 mu 1 dash whole cube. Let us write and see mu 3 dash is equal to 5.5 minus 3 2.5 1 plus 2 1 cube. Solve this. Quickly write the answer in the chat and check it out whether you had written correctly or not. Then the value of mu 4, write the relation mu 4 dash minus 4 mu 3 dash mu 1 dash plus 6 mu 2 dash mu 1 dash square. Please go through the video where we, we have derived this. Okay. Let us write the value of mu4 dash. You can see the value of mu4 dash is 16. So I am writing as 16. Okay. So 16 minus 4 and then it is 5.5 and it is 1. Then 6 and 2.5 and then 1 square minus 3, 1 to the power 4. Students solve this and quickly see the answer. It is coming out to be 6. So this is moment about the mean which was asked in the question. This is the first part of the question which we had solved. Now moving on to the second part of the question where we are required to find moment about the origin. Right. So let us move on. Find the moment about the origin. Okay. So it is moment about the origin. Again students you can see in the last lecture video we studied this the relation between mu 1 and mu 1 and mu 1 and mu 1 dash so you can see mu 1 is equal to x bar which is also equal to mu 1 dash plus a so this slide we are watching from a previous video please go through the previous video to know the formula I am writing the formula here again. So nu 1 is equal to x bar which is equal to a plus mu 1 dash. So what is mu 1 dash? It is 1. What is a? We had calculator here. You can see a we had written 2 because here it is written at the point 2. 
so it is 2 plus mu 1 dash what is the value of mu 1 dash it is 1 ok so let us write the value answer is equal to 3 let us go to nu 2 it is mu 2 plus x bar square this we had derived in our previous lecture I am showing it again this is this one nu 2 is equal to mu 2 plus x bar square I am using this formula ok so nu 2 is equal to mu 2 plus x bar square and I am writing here the answer it is 1.5 plus 3 square x bar we obtained here 3 so I have written here x bar square is 3 and mu 2 is 1.5 you can see here we had obtained the value of mu 2 as 5 1.5 so what is the final answer it is 10.5 let us move on find nu 3 and the formula for nu 3 is mu 3 plus 3 mu 2 x bar again I will say the same thing that I derived this in our previous video so what is the value of mu 3 we have found we have found that mu 3 is equal to 0 ok I am putting it here as 0 then 3 1.5 and then here 3 plus 3 cube and the answer is coming out to be 40.5 let us write the relation of nu 4 and nu 4 is mu 4 plus 4 mu 3 x bar if you remember this it is ok if you do not remember this there is a general formula which we had derived in our previous video go through the general formula also now I am putting the values mu 4 we had obtained here 6 you can see I am writing here 6 plus 4 mu 3 obtained is 0 and then x bar is 3 plus 6 mu 2 is 1.5 and then 3 square and the last one is 3 to the power 4 solve this and get the value we will get the value as 168 so this solve this whole question this question requires finding the moment about mean and finding the moment about the origin when the moment about the point 2 is given ok so students let us move on and solve another question on relations only. So let us move and understand what the second question says. It says that the first three moments of a distribution about the value 2 it means that our arbitrary point is 2 of the variable are 1, 16 and minus 40 and this means that mu1 dash, mu2 dash and mu3 dash are given because it is about an arbitrary point 2 so I am writing here 1 16 minus 40 right what do we have to find we have to find the mean and it is we have to show that the mean is 3 we have to show the variance is 15 and the value of mu 3 also so again in this question we have to use relation relation between the moments okay now we know that mu1 dash is equal to x bar minus a this we had seen uh, in our previous lectures so I am going to that notes also we had shown that this here first one nu1 is x bar and x bar is equal to mu1 dash plus a so x bar is equal to nu1 dash plus a so we have mu1 dash is equal to x bar minus a and what is the value of x bar that is the mean which is required in the question which we have to find is equal to mu1 dash plus a what is the value of mu1 dash it is 1 you can see here 1 plus a what is the value of a it is 2 we had written here so it is 1 plus 2 and the answer that is the mean is coming out to be 3 now second part says find the variance and what is variance variance is the second moment about the mean that is we have to find the value of mu 2 ok so we have to find the value of mu 2 what relation we are going to use relation between moment about the mean and a moment about any arbitrary point I am writing the relation which we had already discussed in detail so this is 16 minus 
1 square and this will come out to be 15 and third part which is asked in the question is the value of mu 3 so let us mu move on and find the value of mu 3 first write the relation 3 mu 2 dash mu 1 dash plus 2 mu dash q which is equal to minus 40 minus 3 16 1 plus 2 1 q solve this write the answer and check your answer it is coming out to be minus 86 okay student so this is another way of using the relation and asking the question in spite of asking that in spite of uh, saying the in the question with find the value of mu 1 mu 2 mu 3 they have said that find the mean find the variance in spite of saying that find mu 2 they had used the word variance because the second moment about the mean is variance and mu 3 we have to find and this completes this question let us move on to question number 3 let us understand what this question number 3 says and it is little repetitive because once we had solved first and second question third will seem to be little repetitive but still let us go on the first four moments about the value 35 is given so it means that we got the arbitrary point a is equal to 35 and the values are given to be these four it means that the values of mu1 dash mu2 dash mu3 dash and mu4 dash are given so i'll quickly write the values minus 1.8240 it is 1 minus 1020 and it is 144 and triple zero what all we have to find mu1 mu2 mu3 mu4 so this one will be mu4 so this we have to find and the question is little very straight they have directly asked what are what are the values of mu1 mu2 mu3 mu4 so mu1 we all know there is no need to find it's zero let us move to mu2 write the relation mu2 dash minus mu1 dash square which is equal to 240 minus minus 1.8 square and the answer will come out to be 236.76 so i am using a calculator you may calculate it directly and again i am writing the formula 3 mu2 dash mu1 dash plus 2 mu1 dash cube let us quickly write mu3 values of all mu's minus 1 0 2 0 minus 3 240 minus 1.8 plus 2 minus 1.8 cube calculate it and you will get the value as 264.36 mu4 and the relation I'm writing it here 4 let us write the values 1 double 4 triple 0 minus 4 minus 1 0 2 0 and then minus 1.8 6 to 40 and then minus 1.8 square minus 3 times it is minus 1.8 to the power 4 solve this and you will get the answer as 141290.11 1. so this question was written straight and directly asked what is the what are the values of mu1 mu2 mu3 mu4 students we have solved three questions in this part if you have any other question you may write in the chat or if you have any query also you may write it 